Oh, babe, he's got a busted thumb. My twin. Twinsies. She feels your pain, bro. Broken knuckle bump. Now that I've got my sarong on, I'm ready to check out this temple. All right, so I thought I was gonna have to put my camera away for this, but we met a cool dude, he's gonna help us out. He gave us a little tour of what all the fountains mean. Basically, we're gonna skip that first fountain because it's a ceremonial fountain. The other fountains that we go through. Healing in different parts of your body, two yeah. through 10. So like, Eyes, nose, ears, throat, chest. That you don't go to 11 and 12. Because those are for cremation. Uh, and then at the very end is for wisdom. Third pool is make a wish and then different chakra. 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 I'm glad we got the tour. It was fun to see yeah. like what the symbolism is for all of this stuff. And a lot of these statues that are outside of the gates are the guardians of the temples. He's gonna bring us those offerings and the leaves. So he's gonna bring us our sacrifice and then we sacrifice it. It's an offering. It says sacrifice on the sign. It's an offering. I'm just using their words. Okay, Great. here's the offering. Offering. Mission. Cheers. Because you want your body is healing, cleansing, and you're able to let the negative character down, there is no nightmare that you got, and also, you wish you can cure. Uh, put your flip flops here. Oh, sorry. And don't worry, you know one will steal it. Oh. Ah. You're doing this like meditation. Close your eye and concentrate your mind to make a permission. Let's go make a wish. out over at Tirta and Pool, and then we grabbed some food, Good. had some massages. Now we're back inside of our castle, and I figured now was the time to go ahead and show you around the place. It's cool. It's pretty cool. Let's go. <gasps> so, first bedroom. This is where we've been staying. We got a nice king-size bed right there. Pow, pow. Random guardians and terrifying faces. We got bookshelves, which are great because you know how much reading you do when you're on vacation. Especially reading like Tax Havens of the World. Super useful information. What's this one? This one's A Girl's Guide to Being a Working Mom. Wow. Let's keep going. Here we have Another little like library kind of room. What would you call this room? Your reception room. Reception, the foyer if you will. Look at this weird wall thing. There's a tiny little closet. Those are hangers. Red futon, random desk. Here is one of the many bathrooms. And it's also completely open air. Film light up the candles <laughs> There's a frog. Where? Oh. You have to see him jump. Oh, okay. He did not jump at us. He did not. Were you trying? I mean, I thought it would be cool for the vlog. No, not for the vlog. For the vlog! No. <laughs> Let's keep going! Oh, 
Oh yeah, I had to duck because uh, this tiny little door thing. Whoa. So cool. A weird like wooden humpback whale thing. There's actually a ton of like crazy faces in this place. Oh, 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 wait, I forgot to say something. Come back over here. This big old bathroom that we just went into, it's terrifying. Let's just say we're sitting on the toilet doing our thing. There's this face right here staring at you. It's just looking right at your stuff. This seems more like Bali. And then this guy, so that's just like some of the faces. There's tons of weird faces around here. Go upstairs. Check it out. Crazy huge stone staircase. We got this awesome like desk here with these guardian dudes that are terrifying to look at. Ooh. Let's just go upstairs. I'll, uh, I'll get B-roll shots afterwards. So yeah, this is... Oh, it's another bathroom. And another huge stone tub. So then we come over here to this other, oh, everything's dark. Okay, hold on. Ow! So I guess I was just a little excited as I was showing the place around and I slipped and hurt myself. I don't know if you guys could see it, but this right here, that's gonna be real gnarly. Uh, Lauren is currently looking for some ice for my wound. It's only a flesh wound. Um, I will finish showing you the place in a bit. It's just casual chat, chilling with you. Hey, how you doing? Doing all right? All right, cool, 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 cool. All right, so we're back upstairs and after a quick first aid, my leg is okay, I guess, but definitely, definitely gonna feel that tomorrow. Anywho, let's continue to explore the upstairs. So there's a bunch of more bedrooms up here. All the bedrooms come with this lovely towel swan right there. Also, I would just like to mention that the Joby Gorilla tripod that I use exclusively for vlogging all the time, this is the second one that I've owned and I just bought it before this trip. It already gave me problems. The thing that's actually like connecting to the tripod isn't staying clipped. So my camera just fell off the tripod. That was fun. And uh, now my autofocus is it quite working very well. So it's just making me a little nervous about that. So we got tons of bathrooms, tons of bedrooms, king size beds, stone bathtubs. It's insane. The Avalon Villas in Bali are the way to go. So especially if you've got like a group of friends or family or a big party that you wanna to get together, these villas are incredible. We are doing the couples route where we've taken the entire villa for ourselves, as you do. Yeah, this place is awesome. And I'm very glad we stayed here. Avalon 1010, highly recommend. Definitely check them out if you're ever in Bali. Tomorrow. <sighs> Tomorrow we're gonna be waking up bright and early, as you do on vacation, right? We're gonna go check out something pretty cool tomorrow, so that's that's gonna be fun. Anyways, this concludes day one of Bali, so if you like this video, go ahead and slap that like button, subscribe if you're not already. Did you show them the last bathroom? Oh yeah, there's one more bathroom. Hold on one second. Pause. Of course, how could I forget? There's still one more bathroom. I got distracted from all of the other bathrooms. So we have another massive stone tub, and we even have this cool mermaid chica. That's a cool shower, man. That's a cool shower. Uh, and also, one thing that's cool about this specific bathroom, we have pool access. It's pretty cool. I don't want to go out there right now because the water will be cold, and I do not do well with cold water. Now I think we're done. We can do this proper sign off. Get over here and say bye to people. See you guys in the next video. Bye!